I said, Cafe Writers Poetry Competition. You're all winners, I can see you in the room. <laughs> Leaflets down there. Um, so part of that charity, I've been interviewing um, soldiers who benefit from the Army Benevolence Fund. And, and one of them is Stuart Harris, um, uh, who got blown up. And several of them, he also found a bear in a garden um, in Bosnia. So this kind of brings those two together. And, um, and this is for Stuart. Um, Bear. Betrayal will happily walk with you, knows your patterns, the roof runs and dead ends of conflict. Conflict will lift you skyward and lay you down on the broken dirt. Stew woke clean white and wondered if this was hell. The bear in the next bed explained it was Birmingham. And over weeks they reminisced, became firm friends. When it was time, the bear came home with him and was too big for the house. The bear blundered about, breaking ornaments, cracked its head against the light, sent shadows skittering about the walls. The bear brooded and the children shrank back from its rancid breath, which made the bear roar. The rooms of the house became dead ends. One night, Stu placed his hand into the bear's paw, and together they walked to the edge of the sea, and were the most sorrowful sight the sea had ever seen. The sea took pity and let them step into her low swell. They clung together while the sea murmured about home until the bear struck out for the moonlit horizon. Stu stood alone on the kitchen floor, water pooled about him. He was so tired his own undone shoelaces were an unfathomable conundrum. 